Hi, welcome back. Welcome back to a dumb raid. Today we're gonna do a flash powder. It's uh, magnesium plus plus meta sodium metabisulfite. That's right, sodium metabisulfite, which contains two sodiums, uh, two sulfurs, and five, five oxygens. oxygens. It's oxygens, a, which is quite a bit of it's a big quite oxygen. Bit of oxygens. Um, it creates a reaction with magnesium that looks something like this. It looks something like that. Yeah. It comes from... Stump out. Well, stump out. Brand stump out. Some stump out. Some other stump out contains sodium nitrate, I believe. Potassium nitrate. Potassium nitrate. nitrate. Um, but this stuff has sodium bet metabisulfite. Metabisulfite. Which is a great oxidizer, as we've found in our... Uh, playing around. And so, when added to magnesium, which is a fantastic reducer, oh yes, it creates that reaction. That reaction that looked like Again. that. Again. Yes. So, we've mixed a non-stoichiometric little chunk of it here, which is dumb. So, we've decided instead to do some actual little crappy math. Stoichiometry. Um, quote unquote stoichiometry. We have magnesium reacting with sodium uh, bimetasulfite, which produces magnesium bimetasulfite, uh, and sodium. As predicted, it's a single uh, replacement reaction, but that's that's possibly not what's going on here. So to yes. test that, we're gonna afterwards we're gonna pour water on it to um, see if there's any sodium residue left over, mm -hmm. and we're also going to think of an experiment to test for magnesium metabisulfite. Yes, and um, as you can see here, we've taken the um, molar masses of them and uh, converted them to grams, then reduced them by a factor of 10, so we can produce them on our little scale over there. So, um, we realized 19 was probably too much, so we just brought it down to 9.5 instead. That's right. Um, 1.22 grams of manganese. Oh. 